Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Emily Freibler. So today's video is going to be a Zaffle haul. They contacted me and saw some of my other haul videos and wanted to send me some things for a video and I said, of course, I would love to. I have purchased from Zaffle before in the past. I actually have a haul from like the spring or something on my channel. I got some sweaters and some bathing suits and stuff. So if you want to go check that out, make sure obviously too if you would like. But like I said, I have ordered from them before and I really like the stuff I got last time. So today I'm going to show you what I picked out from the site and I'm really excited. So let's get started with, with the video. Before I actually like show you a piece, everything will be linked down below for you guys. Make sure you check the description box thing for all the information and also my hair and my makeup. I have videos on my channel, so I will link those down below as well. Okay, so the first two things I wanna mention are accessories. So I got this necklace from them. It's just a really beautiful like layered necklace. I love the way it hits. It's not like too high up as like a choker because it has a longer chain so you can lengthen it. And I love how this just goes down. It looks perfect with this V-neck and I really like it so far. Obviously, it's not gonna be like the best quality Quality jewelry you've ever gotten but I really like how it you know drapes on the neck and everything like that. So the next thing is these sunglasses. You guys always ask about the sunglasses that I wear in videos and these ones I think are so cute. Oh my gosh. So these ones are definitely like a really rounded frame but they also have kind of like that thick band here. I just really love big black sunglasses and these ones are really really cute. So I've been wearing these since I got them like a while ago. My order did come in different sections, like different pieces, you know, so one thing came at this time, one came at this time. It is coming from China, so that will happen, you know? So anyway, I really love these sunglasses and I just think they're a nice like kind of everyday piece. I like them when I have like more of an outfit together though, not really just kind of like running around just because they have more of an unusual shape. Does that make sense? I don't know. Okay, so the first clothing item I want to mention is this really nice blouse. It is a button up and it's actually a short sleeve blouse. I know we're going into like winter and stuff, but I really thought this was beautiful and would look really, really nice with a pair of denim, like black denim or whatever you would like, light denim, anything like that. It is this beautiful button up it has a really nice v and it kind of mimics the v in the back as well so it like drapes really nice on you and it doesn't have a collar like it kind of does it comes up like this but it's not a traditional collar you will see in the try on what i mean and then it has these nice kind of like bigger sleeves with a little slit i just think the details of this are really nice it is a little bit sheer so i would make sure to wear like maybe a black cami underneath or something just to make sure you're not showing off your bra and stuff i really love the fit I love how the arms are a little bit longer they have a little slit in them and they're a little bit more fitted and then it's just kind of like oversized and blousey and I love this collar detail and everything it doesn't go too low or anything and like I said it buttons I just have it tucked in to these light wash jeans and my favorite booties from Amazon and I think it looks really cute this is just a more dress down type of way to wear it because I feel like with blouses like this people think you have to wear them super dressy but they can be dressed down like this this goes pretty long like this and um also long in the back so you could wear it with like faux leather leggings or something like that that would look super cute all black outfit okay so i just unbuttoned the bottom button and then tied up the bottom of it just to make it a little bit more casual as well Okay, next is a sweater. I'm loving this blush color lately. And I got this in a um, bigger size, I believe. I will put all the information for all the pieces on the screen. I don't remember if this was one size fits all or if I got like a big size or what, but it is a pretty big like oversized sweater. I don't know. And it feels really nice. It has like a little bit of distressing on the sleeves here and then also kind of on the... Um, neckline as well and then the bottom of the sweater so 
I really like this. You could totally wear this with leggings or jeans or whatever, just as like a nice oversized sweater. I can never have enough of these in the fall time and winter time. So I really love this color and the quality of this feels really nice. I really love their sweaters. That's probably my favorite thing from them if you could find something that's not cropped because all they have a lot of cropped sweaters, but I'm not really into that. But if you are, check them out. So here's that blush colored sweater. Um, I like it because the bottom is a little bit like elasticy, so it kind of like hugs you. And so it's really nice and easy to kind of like scrunch up and just get that really nice slouchy look if you want that. You could like front tuck it if you're not wearing with leggings. And I just think it's really cute. So here it is long with leggings, obviously. You can see the kind of like distressing on the bottom and the top as well and on the sleeves. Okay, the next thing I got is another like blousey type shirt. This is this like checkered pattern. It's not really like plaid. It's like a maybe it is it's like a checkered plaid maybe white and black and I just thought it looked really classy. This is not this is like a dress shirt material kind of thing. It's a little stiff right now, but I bet if you washed it and put it a little bit of like fabric softener or something in it, it would loosen right up and be a little a little bit softer. So I really like this. You tie this in the front as well, which is really cute with a pair of like high-waisted denim. This is just like really adorable. Yeah, I got this. Again, I got a little bit more like dressier items because I feel like I always wear super duper casual things. But again, you could totally dress this stuff down and wear it with like more casual things as well. Okay, so here is the white blouse. It, like I said, ties here. I just have my distressed black jeans on. It is really cropped I didn't really realize that I kind of forgot when I tried it on a little while ago so I think this is definitely really cute um, I just definitely would make sure my jeans are even more high-rise than these like above my belly button because I'm not a cropped shirt type of person but I do think it is really cute and I really like the pattern of everything okay the next thing I want to mention is another accessory I ended up getting this bag because I thought it was really cute I love quilted bags like this it has a black or it has a gold chain and a you know little black handle up top here I thought this was perfect for the winter time like fall winter time I love a little clutch like this you just flip this part open and then it slides open like this and it has you know a nice size pouch with a or two pockets actually on the inside and then this little pocket in the front here. So it is really nice and I think you could get a lot of use out of it. I know I will. Um, and it's just a really cute kind of like classic looking bag that you can wear with a lot, a lot of stuff. Okay, so I have a few more items and the next thing are these pants. So I don't even know why I got these. I just thought they were my safest bet, I think, other than jeans because I'm so hesitant to order like jeans or anything online. I just know a lot of them don't fit me and stuff like that. So I ended up getting these pants and they're okay, but the material is kind of like stiff and like not stiff in the way it doesn't have stretch, but the material is just a little bit like a little scratchy or something. I don't know how to describe it, but they do have a lot of stretch to them. And again, maybe if I washed them, they would be better, but they have these little slits throughout the leg. And I thought they were going to be more kind of like legging material, but they're not. They're more of like almost a dress pant material. They do have a stretchy waistband and this tie actually does work. So that's really nice. You can like tighten it and cinch it in around your waist. They do fit really nicely. Um, I just don't know what I'm going to wear them with since they are kind of more work pant material versus, you know, leggings, which I kind of was thinking they would be. I don't know why I was thinking that. So here are these pants. You see how they have those slits on them right here? They just are a little bit strange. They definitely like hug my legs and are stretchy. I just put it up so maybe you can tell better. They have like a drawstring here um, and they do have pockets. They're just like a little bit weird. I just don't know how I would style them necessarily. So this shirt is one of those like button up kind of Henley tops and I think it is so cute. These are very trendy right now. This like is a white creamy material. It's like a waffle knit and it has long sleeves and you can tie the front pieces if you would like and it just buttons all the way down. You'll be able to see it a lot better once I try it on. But I just thought this was really cute. You could almost wear this as a cardigan if you wanted or obviously just a button up shirt. Again, I would probably wear a nude cami under this just to make sure nothing 
you know, pops out or anything. Nothing's super see-through, but you could wear this with leggings or dark denim or something like that. And I think it would look really cute. So I just wanted one of these and it's super soft and comfy looking. So, and feeling. So I really like this. Isn't this the cutest? It is so soft, so cozy and warm. Here is it untucked obviously with those black jeans and booties, but obviously you could dress this down even more with just some leggings. It is a little bit see-through, like I said. You can definitely see the black here, so make sure with your bra and everything you're wearing the appropriate stuff. Here it is, just tucked into jeans really casually. A um, really nice fluffy scarf over this would be really cute as well. I just think it is the most adorable and softest cozy shirt that you could wear so many different ways. Okay, this next sweater, you guys, is so soft. This is the probably the best quality thing I've gotten from them, um, and it is the softest material Ever. So this is a nice v-neck sweater and it laces up the back so it has like a lace detail in the back This is really cute with a bralette underneath you could show that peeping through um, Or you could use one of those sticky bras and then you won't have anything on your back showing And it has long sleeves as well. Obviously, it's a really like stretchy sweater material I don't know what it's like made with but it is beautiful. It's a really nice like kind of short sweater See how it's shorter like this, but it's not like super cropped or anything, which I very much enjoy. Um, so yeah, this would look really cute with dark denim or even black denim, anything really. It's just like a really, really nice sweater and I'm totally gonna get a lot of use out of this. I am really excited about this one. All right, so here is that super duper soft white sweater that laces up in the back. I just have it on with high-waisted leggings right now. You could obviously wear jeans with this as well, but I just kind of like the sleek all black look on the bottom with the black booties as well. And this is so soft, you guys. I cannot get over saying that, but it's so soft. All right, so there is the back. I don't know if you can see that that well, but it goes down pretty low um, and it looks really nice. I have one of those sticky bras on, so yeah, there you go. Okay, the next thing I got looks like a blanket, but it is not. This is one of those kind of like teddy bear coats, but this is one that is open. So it doesn't have like a zipper or anything. It's more kind of something to throw on over as a coat, but not like when you want it to be together. <laughs> I don't know if that makes sense. So it obviously has a hood. It's that really classic like light shade and then it's white on the inside. So I really like this. The only problem is I believe I got a large because people were saying that the arms were too short and stuff and I definitely should have gotten a medium. So definitely go true to size with this one. It is definitely too big for me and I think I could get away with it if I wore like all tight fitting clothing underneath like you know all black tight fitting clothing or something and then this on top because otherwise I feel like I just swim in it. So if you don't want it to be like super duper oversized, go with your true size and it would be totally fine. This thing though you guys is the warmest jacket I own, I believe. Like I wore this when it was pretty cold down here. I think it was like 50 degrees outside or something at night. We were doing a trunk or tree and I wore this and I was like hot in it. It was so, so, so warm. So if you want something super cozy and warm to like even just wear around the house, this is beautiful and so cozy. So I just have been wearing this around the house or using it as a blanket. It is so warm. And so soft. I, I really like this. And I would highly recommend checking out all the other teddy bear coats from them because there's some other really cute ones on there as well. So. All right, you guys. I told you it was really big on me. Like the arms are definitely really long. So I would say go true to size with this. But it is so warm. And I feel like if I got my real regular size, it would work really good for me because I love the like look of it other than the fact that it's super duper oversized but it's so warm and I probably will wear it just like a little bit during the um winter months when I'm back home in Michigan and it's really cold over like a December time so it's really really cozy though and I think it looks cute with like an all black outfit you definitely need to have tight fitting bottoms on though otherwise you're gonna look super big and frumpy all right you guys that is it for this haul i hope you enjoyed it and seeing all the pieces that i picked up definitely remember to check out all the links to everything that will be in the description box as well thank you again to zaffle for sending all these clothes to me and i will see you guys in a video very very soon bye guys Ooh.